Hello everyone. First of all, allow me to say thank you to everyone who have just watched my first tutorial on making the Back to the Future title and edit them with Sony Vegas Pro along with uh, Title Pro 4. And based on that, I want to try the second time here now doing it with hit film 3 express and this is the recent done i just did similarly with hit film 3 express which just uh, announced as free and as for you who just watched first time this tutorial i only going to explain here on how to composite them and make the glow effect in hit film 3 and if you want to watch on how to design this title in title pro you can watch my first tutorial start by analyzing and studying the real original title and continue to edit and starting all the required material in title pro 4 from new blue fx and this is a great title software if and you will benefit a lot if you are working a lot with titling program just check out newbluefx.com if you want to know more about this title program you can st uh, watch from start until about minute of six since hit film 3 express edition doesn't support title pro external plugins uh, i have prepared the titles here by rendering each required layer to png sequence by giving them frame rate of 50p uh, the double frame rate of pal 25p so to ensure that i have the best interface ready material and also the the outline use for masking use i've made similarly to sony vegas so let's begin hit film 3 express new project and 1080p full hd 50p and start compositing import as sequence just select the main select folder 50p yes import image outline only done it so as usual stack them together and here let's properties the duration is just 12 seconds and here we are so the first step will be make another composite shot based on this one so here we are and this is just Okay, uh, please note that Hit Film 3 is still a new software to me, so I might be a bit slow in working in here. So, if there is any trouble or anything, please apologize about that. So, I'm going to start here and I will add this new plane and we'll start by having 540 so i have half height i will make the same process since hit film doesn't have three color gradient like sony vegas does have i simulate them using two separate planes where one of the planes doing color gradient from black to white and the other plane showing gradient from white to black 
it's good to rename now that uh, so you can understand them and make this as a child to wine gradient and after this you can just unlink and scale them so now we have the similar gradient just like I have prepared previously I will keep the outline here as a preview reference so I know where the position will be needed okay let's start by the first title where it's supposed to start okay let's make it about five uh, turn on the mass and rotation put below just need it while we start at around here there so here we go and for the to the future text will be done later now let's see if this work oh I need to put another outline media here but hide them and instead I will have to use set mate so it will mask the whole this composite program to outline and I just want this blended as screen or add to bottom media okay okay let's try adding glow to see how's the effect turn Okay, sounds good. And going is hot. Well, set the color to more blue. Just like I did. Or oh, not? Oh, sorry. I think should be done here. Let's make it more blue rather than cyan. Okay. Here we go, and hmm. wait. Okay, uh, let's experiment with other color to see which giving the best one. Okay, change to add and blend. Okay, this one the effect is more intense here and this is just the the look I really wanted. So let's see. Okay, that's quite lovely. Okay, good. At mask, I make a spirit of the layer to two parts. So, okay, the effects work perfectly. Now, the remaining is the adjustment. Now, let's start with the second to the future area. So, let's see if I can do the same. Duplicate. Oh uh, no instead a new layer plane copy plane and then make composite shot as vttf 
to the feature com okay and copy and paste so okay remove and this one only have 10 seconds so okay so copy and paste transform okay now for the mask I can just now move to the bottom part so this layer can be start at seconds of 4 hmm? white oh okay blend option is similar to add and I can cut this composition here so we'll start at seconds of 4 while I can cut the remaining okay copy pasting is done so let's continue gradient is done and the next is just to transform to ensure that the masking works properly uh, we'll add a mask here so feather on it so with a strength okay and during its fade I made uh, about two seconds only and it will go down that's it and make doesn't have to be too strong mm. well uh, I guess I should have hide this mask as well so I can create the simulate them here but the process is similar just like I did this mask so yes that can be Done. For the optional step here, you can add another optional glow, second glow here with another intense glow radius. So you can have another more intense effect, especially in the arrow. And not just here, for additional bonus, you can do another one by duplicate this one but come to but for this one I can create another mask where it will just pin this location only so I want to add more highlight here
okay while Shuri Tesson here I can put screen soft light screen Okay, so that's it. That's how I create them. And finally, you can just export the whole. I export as PNG sequence, GBA content area, prefix as BTTF two fifth to demo and export them. Eh? Oh composite shot content area export to G six final UA. and let's wait so I hope this demo can help everyone on understanding how to make compositing here in HitFilm 3 Express and as for me is to train myself on learning the workflow better so see you again later on the next tutorial